Hey there, it's Joe with Sonical Disruptive. How are you? I am well. I'm just hanging out at a hotel for the night, and uh, it's a loud hotel too. So if you hear doors slamming, people yelling, screams, whatever you might hear at a hotel, pay no attention. There's nothing I can do about it. I can't control the outside noise. That being said, I want to listen to some Catatonia. I'm going to carry on listening to the Fall of Hearts record. And uh, I left off with Serene. So I'm going to do Serene. And then I'm going to go directly into the next song that I haven't listened to, which is Decema, which has been requested. So I'll be doing that directly afterwards. And let's get started with this right now. In the morning, the battle for endurance has been lost. Sold my worth and dignity the same. I am shame, an essence of corroding time. a lot of good long
so good. Going right to December. Alright, so both of those songs are absolutely perfect. Catatonia are one of these bands, at least this album, 
I heard a few songs prior to this album, and they were good, but they weren't quite this. The songs I've heard on this record, you get that feeling that everything is absolutely perfect. Like, there's no way you could add or take anything away from it. It is perfection as is, and the mix on both of these songs. Um, absolutely incredible. Just crystal clear. You can hear every instrument, and I feel their song craft, their composition is next level. And I say that in a way where these songs are done sparsely, but very layered and very textured. And what that gives you is this perfect, beautiful sound. They don't try to get too tricky. Sometimes bands try to get too tricky and it takes away from the song. They don't do that here. You just have beautiful instrumentation, very well done. The drums on both of these had some really cool and interesting fills. The lyrics here are the real glue to these songs. He is such a great lyricist, so visual. You can put yourself right into that very position and put yourself right into the song because of the lyrics. And his voice is incredible. Um, it's one of those voices to me that just, you hear it and you are instantly right there in this state of mind that they want to put you in. Really good at controlling you with their songs. Um, first song had some really nice, rich, full sounding chords in the chorus, which is nice. The acoustic in Decima, absolutely beautiful. I love that acoustic line. And once again, the instrumentation is done in such a way where it doesn't overpower anything. There's nothing here too fancy, too technical to take away from the soul of the song, but definitely technical enough where you can tell there was a lot of thought going into the writing process in composing this song and this music. Um, two great songs. Really, really looking forward to the uh, City Burials release coming out on April 24th. Can't wait for that. Um, I am a huge fan of this band, and I am so glad I found that. Finding these bands like this that, of course, have been around forever, but I just started listening to them makes this worth it, you know, very much so. You can't really put a price on finding a new favorite band. That's one of those things you can't really put a price tag on um, because it will feed you kind of for the rest of your life if you love a band. And that is really cool. So thank you for coming along with me on this journey. Thank you for watching and see ya.